Now, the anticipation for this election has been higher than ever, really, with a number of issues, North Korea, the economy, jobs and so on, facing the nation. But how do you really measure election fever among the voting public? Ian Shin has more. What better way to really feel the excitement of Election Day than to take a peek at social media in Korea, one of the most wired countries in the world? Schools out, works off, so people have time to vote. When they get to their local polling station, voters get a stamp on their hands once they turn in their ballot as a sign of their participation. Pictures of the stamps are trending now on sites like Facebook and Instagram, in posts by people of all ages, from college students to people much older and with more gray hair. As for the trending hashtags on Twitter today, you guessed it, expressions like vote now, I voted, or done are burning up the site as we speak. And people aren't just saying it with words and pictures. They're also posting cartoons and short movies created by local artists that encourage citizens to vote. Celebrities are also joining the fun. Their websites show everything from lighthearted photos of them posing in front of polling stations to more serious messages like, you don't vote, you don't complain, meant to convey the importance of voicing their opinion by voting. With so much excitement coming from all around the country, it seems the results are going to be just as widely discussed among voters tomorrow in what could be the next social media trend. Ian Shin, Arirang News.